Hello there. I'm going to show you how to do the move action if you have absolutely no idea what you're doing because bruh, OBS. Yes. Hey. First, you get an image. If you're going to move a video source, we'll go over that in a second. Anyway, moving an image, here's an image for you. Go down to the scene that we are on itself. In this case, it's look at the small screen. Right click it and go to filters. We go here and we add a filter. In this case, move source. Click. We will call it something useful. In this case, the starting location of Mr. Bezos, which will be uh, Bezos start. And click OK. Now, you go to the source area and add the source itself. In this case, Jeff Bezos PNG PNG2. And you go down to transform right here and click get transformation. Click. That is now set to go to that location whenever we make this scene visible. So if I move this to the side, grab Mr. Bezos, and move him away over here, and then we click on here and make it visible, he zips back to that location. That alone is useful enough. So if you want him to go to a second location, add another filter. In this case, we'll call it Move source, Bezos end. And don't we all wish for Bezos' end? Again, go to the source and add the thing itself. Wherever you want the new location to be, click on it, put it here. We'll put him right next to me. Go down to Get Transform, click it, and now it's set to that location for Bezos End. So we click on Bezos Start, Neom, and we go back to Bezos End very fast, just like that. That little guy moving across the screen was using this move thing with voice control and streamer bot. So right there, is as much as you need to start off with if you're gonna control everything with StreamerBot. If you wanna move a video source, instead of moving move source, you'll have to click move video capture device. Now you can either have these be clicked visibly to move him back and forth, or you can set chains of things. So you go all the way down to the bottom to the action section right here. And here you see that you can select when the trigger starts, such as when you have it visible, the actual picture itself, or when you switch to that scene, or a hundred other options. And then have a next move. So the move that'll go to when that move is finished. So we go to Bezos start, and, and when we switch to him, the current location, which is there. And then we go to Bezos end, right there. You saw how he's flipped there? Well, we can have him go to that location by going all the way down to the bottom. Next move, Bezos end. We hit Bezos start now. It goes to first the original location, and then to Bezos end. Now, this alone allows you to get into the infinite possibilities of this add-on. And you can let your mind go wild, but this alone will start you down the path of an enlightenment. Anyway, good luck to you, Godspeed, and I hope this helps at all.